Right, time for some tea, and it's going to be gas all the way. Um, the temperature's dropping now. I might have to put some more layers on shortly. However, I will try and resist for as long as I can. MSR micro rocket stove. Get this screwed on here and uh, make sure that valve's tightened up. I've got the old mitts on. Top tip, mitts. Fingers are free to do what you need to do around camp. Okay. In terms of cooking equipment, we have MSR Titan kettle. It's not the flattest little bit of ground, but it's going to do. Um, yeah, there we are. So, yeah, look what we found. Beef follow. I don't even know if I'm in shot. I can't even see. Get that down there. Maybe that's a bit better. Right. This is what we're on. Beef bolognese. And put in the bag rice. Dead simple. Keep it simple, as Quinlan would say. Right. Okay. So you will find they will fit into the MSR Titan kettle just fine. A little bit of bending. And there you go, we're in. Rice in. Get a bit of water in. Boil that for 10 minutes. The bolognese is already cooked, just needs heating. By the time the rice is done after 10 minutes, that'll be lovely. Um, that is all we need. Don't put too much in or you'll find it'll boil over a la Walshy, a la Barry Chuckle. If you haven't seen it, watch Mount Etna erupt on the uh, on the last wild camping video while well, she's struggling to boil a jet boiler water um, but yeah that's great that's just about enough water in there every time I light this it gives me a fright because it explodes let's see if that happens again no, managed to stay calm here we go And we're on. Bad mannered. That's boiling already. Just lower that down a touch. Can't beat these um, MSR stoves. I like rapid. They are just rapid. Anyway, right beer. It smells like beer. It smells like an IPA. What a red rye IPA, I don't know. I presume it contains red rye. That's lovely, that. Really is nice. Um, give us some colourage. There we go. Bit of a red hue to it. As you can see, we're boiling up nicely there. 10 minutes, 10 minutes on the old timer. I think you've steamed up. 
Yeah. Ten minutes on the timer there. And um, we'll be cooking on gas in more ways than one. Nice tea, another little handy tip. Just get a bottle of this. That was 75p from Aldi by the tills. A little antibacterial hand wash. Just make sure you stay clean around camp um, in the absence of proper washing stuff. I'm going to have a bit of a tidy up. It's quite cold now. Um, I'm just going to relax in the hammock. I'm going to read my book. Robert McFarlane, Mountain to the Mind. Well recommended if you haven't read it. To sum it up, the gripping history of man's irresistible and sometimes fatal attraction to big hills. Great read. Care to see one of the lads in wear. Um, so I am gonna crack on with that, get me sleeping bag, drink beer, and read all about the world's highest mountains. Doesn't really get better than that. Having a brilliant time, this is why I do it. everyone there's not much more to be said from me this evening on this one I've got three beers left it's raining so I'm not going to be having a fire I'm just going to chill out swing in my hammock enjoy the rest of my beers and um, read my book I'm in a really peaceful time I've got my mitts on stylish as ever and uh, I'll probably have an earliest night really and make the most of it if I don't speak to you tonight again I will see you in the morning I don't know if you can hear the church bells, but it's so relaxing. We've got the candle lantern on. There's the church bells drifting across the fields. And it's just ultimate, ultimate relaxation. Time for another beer. All right, back to the GoPro. Let's check out this cheeky little number. It's a Common Grounds Triple Coffee Porter. Triple Coffee. Look at the can, look at the artwork. We've got some ravens, uh, some oak leaves from the Magic Rock Brewing Co. It's five and a half percenter. Uh, this is beer number four. Exquisite artwork. Well, it's that sort of like monstery type theme again. Um, so. Don't know what that's all about, but let's go for the one-handed open. Let's do a bit of manoeuvring. Look at the candle lantern there. I don't know if you can hear the church bells, but it's just absolute bliss. Right, here we go, look at that. It's like staring down into the bog of eternal stench on Labyrinth. I've just been hit. It's like someone smashed a sack of coffee beans over my face. And it's, uh, it's still four foot away. Here we go, let's bring it closer. Oh, 
that is unbelievable that's a coffee lover's dream that one and i love coffee uh so that is cracking it's just like it's just like throwing yourself head first into the grounds being at starbucks um lovely lovely coffee porter i'm gonna sit here enjoy it and listen to the church bells well good night folks speak to you in the morning right <clears throat> morning glampers excuse the fact that i look like i've been run over it's always what happens when you wake up out of a hammock especially at this time of year um i don't know what's happened to the spring weather yesterday was amazing uh, today we've gone back to the eternal winter which uh, we've been in for the past god knows how long um, it was a bit of a cold night I underestimated just how cold it would be I slept in mitts got a down jacket on under this um, lined pants all I brought was a foil foil lined sleep mat but it was very very cold throughout the night I should have brought a sleep mat in hindsight but there you go we live and learn the great British weather I'm having a coffee and I'm going to pack up, go home and get dry and warm. Right, folks that's it from me on this one what turned out to be a really sunny start to yesterday has ended up like this wet damp but otherwise still good fun please show your support to the channel by hitting the subscribe button give the video a thumbs up if you like it i reply to all constructive uh, comments check us out on twitter at mcm outdoor show we're also on facebook like our official page and join our group get involved in some discussion we're also on instagram find us on there I'll see you at the weekend for a wild camp in the English Lake District. Look forward to it. See you on the next adventure. Over and out.